So what is a ConOps? So if we go with the IEEE definition, a ConOps is a user-oriented document that describes system characteristics of the to-be-delivered system from the end user's viewpoint. So basically what it's saying is you are trying to figure out or trying to understand what the frontline personnel using the system is, needs or what the priorities and concerns are in order for them to do their job. This is IEEE's definition. If you look at ANSI's definition, I'm not going to read that. It's, it's a mouthful. Uh, but if you do read it, it's basically saying the same thing. Uh, it's saying that we need to be able to extract the frontline personnel's uh, needs and priorities uh, and understand it to make sure we can address their concerns. So what is a con ops from a CBTC perspective? What I talked about earlier, the two definitions, they're generic definitions used across many industries, aerospace more specifically, because this is really where the con ops uh, is, is coming from. So in a CBTC perspective, um, it's written with the transit agency's end users uh, in mind. It does not describe the CBTC solution. Uh, this is a solution that's provided by the supplier. It's not talking about the core functionality. It's talking about the environment in which the CBTC solution resides in. Um, and upon completion, the engineers who use this, uh, uh, the CONOS, they can use it to create the uh, technical specification. And when they do, it will be addressing directly the, con the, the priorities and concerns of the end users uh, of, the, of the system. So if we look at a typical CBTC system, it has your ATS, your wayside controller, your train born controller. And if we were to confine that into a circuit and call it a CBTC system, this is what the supplier is providing to the transit agency. Um, and, but the con ops, it's not concerned with the green part. It's only concerned about the blue part that's uh, enveloping the CBTC system or the, the environment in which the CBTC system is going to reside within. Uh, this is where all of the, the frontline personnel are, are working in order to meet the daily operational needs, uh, the maintenance personnel, the operators, the instructors, et cetera, et cetera. So the con ops is focused in the blue uh, shaded area uh, of the uh, transit agency's uh, environment. It is defining the operating environment. 